Okay, quick addendum to the tools needed for the 1911 build. I realize I left out a couple that uh, you probably have lying around anyway, but you will need non-marring hammers, rubber mallet, rawhide mallet, whatever you got. You're going to need a little bit of a heavy one to be able to bang that uh, slide onto the frame when you're, when you're lapping that on. You may need a little extra help, so a non-marring hammer works. Hammer like this also works but uh, just be cognizant it does have metal on it so if you swing and a miss and you and you hit with the metal you may dent ding or scuff up your frame or slide regular hammer I uh, use for driving out the pin on the barrel link that things in there kind of tough so you will need a regular hammer uh, punch set uh, these roll pin punches whatever punches will work brass punches uh, in case you're tapping on your sights or, or uh, something you don't want to mar your finish. Some brass punches. Bench block uh, really helps keeping everything lined up when you're knocking out some pins. Uh, little things, little tiny screwdrivers, some thread locker you might need if, if you're putting on a, a magwell or something, something that's uh, threaded on there, you'll need some thread locker or the over travel screw on your trigger that will need to be thread locked in or it will work itself out. Uh, so a little, little pair of little grabbers here. This helps for putting the sear and, and disconnector into the frame. You'll need something small. You can't get, I can't get my fat fingers in there. So you'll need something small to hold that in place while you're uh, putting the sear pin in. These work really well. Um, yeah, and that's about it on the tools. Next video, I will show you all of the parts you'll need for the build. Uh, yep, yeah, that's it. See you next time.